our report looked at uh, why it is that the United States, uh, despite spending more on health care than uh, any other country, uh, uh, experiences much lower life expectancy and higher rates of disease and injury uh, than is the case in other similar countries with high income, such as the countries in Europe, Canada, Japan, Australia. Americans live shorter lives and face greater risks of disease and injury than people who live in other high-income countries. Our report tried to understand what might be responsible for this, and we undertook a systematic examination of a range of potential uh, causes for why Americans are in poorer health than their counterparts in other countries. This report uh, follows a previous report that had shown that Americans age 50 and older uh, have shorter life expectancies than older adults in other high-income countries. Our examination extended the analysis and found that this problem goes back to earlier age groups, in fact, all the way to the beginning of life. We found that American babies are less likely to survive to their first birthday uh, than babies born in other high-income countries. Uh, young children are less likely to survive till age five. Uh, American adolescents are in worse health than their counterparts in other countries. American adults uh, have higher rates of obesity, diabetes, and other chronic diseases. There are higher rates of deaths from car accidents and from violence in the United States than in other countries. Um, we live in a country that is racially and ethnically diverse. We have a lot of poverty in the United States. There might be a tendency to think that this health disadvantage has something to do with the health disparities that exist in those populations. And indeed, they do have worse health outcomes. But our analysis found that even when the data are restricted to uh, upper income, well-educated Americans, uh, people who are white or who have health insurance, and even people who have healthy behaviors such as not smoking or having a healthy weight are still in worse health than uh, similar people in other high-income countries. The most obvious recommendation after conducting this analysis is that our society has to pay much greater attention to public health priorities around the specific health conditions where we have a disadvantage. Obesity, diabetes, infant mortality, and the other conditions where Americans are in worse health than their counterparts in other countries are all areas that are important targets for public health strategies uh, that have been identified in the United States and that are known to be effective. We need, as a society, to focus our attention on, on providing resources and, uh, and energy around addressing those important public health priorities. A second recommendation of our panel is the need to alert the American public to the existence of this problem. Uh, we think that uh, a lot of Americans are aware of the fact that there are problems with our health care system, but many of them may not realize that we are at a disadvantage when it comes to our health, that they and their children are likely to live shorter lives and to live in greater illness and, and in poor health than people in other high-income countries. Uh, we think it's important to make Americans aware of this and to stimulate a national discussion about what we, we as a society are prepared to do about it. A third recommendation is that we think it would be useful to look at the policies that countries with better health outcomes uh, have used to achieve those health gains and whether any of those strategies might be adaptable to the United States. It's important to say that this is not a contest uh, between the United States and other countries. Uh, the point of this comparison and the tragedy in the data that we're finding is that we know from the superior health outcomes that other countries have achieved that we too uh, can uh, offer those types of health outcomes in the United States and that our uh, population and our children can live longer lives uh, because it's been demonstrated elsewhere.